Thursday the 5th of June 2014, the world changed for 16 people. They transformed from members of the public to housemates. This was day one in an experience that would change them forever, 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 forever. It started when the public gave Pauline the power and Pauline put Matthew in a box. Maybe a bad decision. I didn't mind really. Yeah, you did. And Pauline gave Mark five grand. <laughs> what a waste of money. It only took until day five before the first proper argument started when Danielle said, Get some bloody class, you weirdo man. Which, well, nobody expected from her. Then, three days later, we had our first kiss when Tamara and Winston smooched. Oh, get a room. By the second week, Jale and Pauline had locked horns. Come here, you bloody chicken. Something about chicken? Then, in the second week, Chris secretly had the power. By day 14, Hurricane Toya was blowing a gale through the house. Come in, raise no force. I disagree. And by day 17, she finally blew herself out after saying, Can everyone just calm the down? To Ash, Winston and Marlon. She was the next to leave. On day 20, Helen called Matthew a, um... Pigeon, Chester, skinny I have to say it. Listen, don't over-egg your part, Matthew. By day 31, it was getting real, and the house fell out. Well, Ashley fell out with Kimberly during the seance task hosted by Mark. Ashley said Stephen could do much better, but trust me, he couldn't. And three days later, Marlon pushed a little button and caused a big mess. Everyone hated him after this. Go on, press the button. You know you're watching. Oh, the button, the button. Oh, press it, Marlon. Press it. Button. Okay, you're a silly boy. Two days later, Stephen asked Kimberly to open it, <laughs> which we were all very excited about. Four days later, though, Marlon was evicted in his pants. Armageddon struck when Pav, Zoe, and Bianca entered the house. And Bianca wanted to uh, ride Winston's <laughs> Three days later, Ash and Helen kissed. Yay! Then, on day 54, we had letters from home. <laughs> and there was a rainbow. Oh, yeah, and at some point, then Mark and Christopher became a thing. On day 57, though, the house found out from a focus group that everyone thought Mark was playing a massive game. Oh, giant dice. Massive game. I like it. Mark and Winston were evicted and that's all you need to know. <laughs>